We're here at H-E-L-N-L Stadium in Gehenna, Texas. Owner GM and coach Scary Clones wants his newly completed art installation to get the crowd pumped. But most are just wondering why a bunch of naked painted orcs are gyrating in the lobby. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The New York Tyrants go up against the Malice Hellboys. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Are you ready for some MFL action? Am I? I love MILFs! Mutants I'd like to fuck! He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you half-wit. Ow! Oh, I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime milk lingerie girls team! What a zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all! Ho ho! Va 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 voom! And it's first and ten. That's a catch for a one-yard gain. That's not going to do it, fellas. Second down and nine. Great play by the defense. Results in an interception. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter of the three rim, Read it. but my watch is a bit slow. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> nice run for five yards. Second down and five. The lineman swats the ball away with those meaty paws. God, it looks so snuggly. Yeah, I guess if you're a monster. Third down and five. hard first down first and two And that'll be second and eight to go. Third down and ten. Throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. Now well, they don't have enough faith in their offense to put it in the end zone, so they're taking the easy route. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object.
The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. The 30. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. Oh, so close, but not today. Hmm. I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned NFL rule. And this is a first and long. And the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down and forever. Second down in a mile. And the runner is going to bring it back. Look at the path you've taken up. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? Yeah, man. I was huge on the panel now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. This guy's a brick shit house. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. First and ten. Good thing you know, a good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gordon. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. I think they want to hit those last two runners for this man. First down and one. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Actually, he does have some turkey skin wrapped in on his backside from that bad burn he had last year. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's the return of the ball. Return of ball? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for, you know what? Never mind. And 
and it's first and ten. Well, he made the pass, but then a slap in the face by the defense. Oh, that's me in the hotel bar every night. Hey, your opening line needs work. Why? Really? What's a pretty girl like you doing here all by herself? Are you a hooker? Well, it's a fair question. And that's another pick. Man, oh, man. Vince is going to have more risk. He is fighting for every yard. Ouch. What is this? And he's wrestling? Yo, man, nobody can touch you on eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? And it's first and ten. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. And they'll keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And he gets three yards on that run. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Finally. Third down and a pussy here. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that. You gotta be fucking kidding me. If that's a penalty, they should come up here and penalize us, too. Hey, don't give these reps any ideas, you idiot. Brent, I just dash. On it. And it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Touchdown. Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. He's got his beast boot working. The player just transformed into a violent form of pure badass. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. 
And he's run. Touchdown! And he rips off a game-breaking run for the score. comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. I turned out the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed, it was a chimp wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. Second down in a lot. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm the greatest, greatest, I tell you. <laughs> When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger, because he's gonna kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message, because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. And it's first and 10. One in for the first down. And it's first and ten. He is rolling thunder and pouring pain. It's, oh man, the offense called a murder. And he fumbles at bricks. That was a screwed up play if I ever saw one. Chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Hey. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. Looks like this one's coming back. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player.
And it's first and ten. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. Second down and nine. Crunch. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And the MFL winning is really about how much you wanted, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. Ah, that's a good point, Grim. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. Two, nine, nine. The ground game should be their breath. I ate a piece of licorice once and got a shock like that. It wasn't licorice, you idiot. It was the frayed cords of the leaf blower. Well, it was a red cord and it looked like licorice. The point is, ah, I forgot my point. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Third down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And the quarterback throws into the... Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Fill him. And it's first and ten. He refuses to go. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to. Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. And the defense spiked the offensive water with strawberry fields. And now they can taste some. Oh, man, Brick, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. And the defense gets another pick. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away. Don't you just love the sound of... Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. done for a first down. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. <laughs> first 
First and four. Second down and six. Hey, think you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. They want more points, and so they're going for two. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? Huh? Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. My car got the light. It wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. One, hot two, hot, hot. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know what. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Uh, same as Britch's ex-girlfriend signaled when they... That ball was almost intercepted. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And he just slipped away like a greased pig. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. And he runs it in for an easy two points. The momentum in this game may be shifting. Oh, those are just my balls. Hey, thanks for sharing, Bricks. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. with the brain scrambler. And it's first. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. Well, this kick is no guarantee. Sure it is. If he misses, he's fired. Guaranteed. Well, surprise me, he made it look easy and he gets three points for it. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. Hey, man, he's going to get him now. Oh, my God. <laughs>
Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty Trick. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Briggs? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Well, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Huh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they don't have the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? I don't really know right now. What day is it? It's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. Oh, great play! He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Bricks. Hot, very smart. Hot one, eight. And another, and oh, nice hit. Boo, baby, I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> and it's first and ten. He's supercharged and can electrocute any ball just slice through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were fumble. You've got to protect the ball better than that. It's a touchdown! Is that right, Ben? That penalty makes no sense. Okay, something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps outside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps offside to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. 
And it's first and ten. It's two yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay it for the pick six. For this, you just give them a pat on the head and tell them they don't suck. Third down and eight. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Turner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. away. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Oh, my God. A man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. First down and six. Hot. Hot one. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. is down to their last two linemen. Once they're gone, it's game over. Yeah, who cares? Linemen suck. They don't even deliver any fantasy points. And it's first and ten. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. their 
last running back. If they lose him, they lose all their running plays. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. And the defense spiked the offensive water with Strawberry Field. And now they can taste sound but can't remember what the concept of time is. Sounds like you every day. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8, the greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Wham! Lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. Yeah, lucky to survive so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. I like this. They're going for two. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Second down and ten. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Third down and ten. Ah, another interception. Oh, with the punishing hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. And that pass finds its target. A pickup of six yards on the play. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot two, hot. He scores! They're going for two points. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten.
And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot. And he's off to the races. Touchdown! And he rumbles that one into the end zone. Nicely done. I can't run like that unless it's Cooper Knight and Taco Hell. He is there for what though to me? On a kind of not clenching his cheeks, though. Well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you talking about Two point plays are high risk, high reward, and it just didn't pay off. And now they're both screwed and stupid. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. I don't know whose eyes they boom. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completion. He could go all the way. And the defense is on his heels. A lifesaver there. First down and five. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. And it's first and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. It's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more 
Bricks. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, Good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. They're gaining on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a song I'm writing on this asshole. And it's first and ten. They call the one feet dirty brick. And there's another pick. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. He might catch him. Move your fat little mutant. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, his head just exploded. Play it, miss. Play it, miss. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> And it's first and goal. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. <laughs> first down and one. Does the QB know which team? Oh, he just got crushed. I'm a high scale on Silla. I am a hell of a fellow. And it's first and ten. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough. And he's off. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? Now, nah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. <laughs> Didn't work that time. It was close, though. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. And he zings it in there for a nine-yard completion. They are moving the ball now with authority. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Bricks' match stupsy time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. <laughs> Second down and long. Defender lays down a wicked hit and knocks the ball loose. The receiver just got smashed. Not as bad as me last night. He may be dead, but trust me, he's in better shape than I am right now. Oh, geez, here it comes. Blah. You can't keep a good mutant. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. Man, 
and these guys have and they take their first time out here the quarterback apparently needs a few more seconds to explain put the ball in the end zone to the slower players and the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt his knitting is a time cramp that cross pitching unbelievable nice catch and it turns on the afterburners punt returners in this league have a life expectancy of three returns let's see if he beats the odds Touchdown! That's an awesome punt return for the score. What a play! With kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. See what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And the quarterback goes into a hurry up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And like Bricks and Bowles, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He is coming him. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. so neither team can put their players on the bench. And he punched his way out. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit... And that's another turnover for the defense. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. And they're catching up. Joke, job, do something. No touchdown today! Looks like that defender ate his bleedies this morning. And it's first and ten. And with another pick, the QB says... I don't know what's wrong. And he finds open space. He's running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. The 20. The and the defense is on his heels. Hey, hey, Grim, you ever dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? Uh, this isn't the devil brick. It's just one of them. Oh, that don't make it any less scary. Ghost. <laughs> And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. to a one-hole highlight. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. And these guys think kicking is 
Bricks for Pussy's Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grin. Yeah, bigger than yours. The kicker is going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Pick up three on a short pass. Second down and seven. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. First down! I see this guy. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, Saban Bricks is ex Ah, another interception. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Oh, boy. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. He intercepted the QB's pass and returns it for a touchdown. That's not just salt on the moon. That's peeing in the ashes and the smoldering remains. <laughs> okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And he recovers the fumble. He runs it back for a defensive score. That's a backbreaker for the offense. <laughs> the burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The Hellboys are defeated today. They've got 99 problems, but a win ain't one of them. That's right, Grim. Just like a bridge over the troubled water. Like a whole lot of Rosie. The game's most valuable player is speaking about the victory now. <laughs> Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation.